name is Sierra Book. And I know it's been a while. It's been about probably like three weeks or a month. One of the two. Um, yeah, nothing much has happened. We moved to a new apartment. Um, and yeah, I guess I really just, I guess I like, maybe I was like setting up. I really don't have an excuse, honestly. Like I'm just in the moment type of person. Um, but yeah, so I wanted to try to do like weekly vlogs to see if you guys like those. That way it's longer um, and you kind of get to see like into my life a little bit more than it just being like a day of like whatever I'm doing. Honestly, my life is pretty boring and that's how I like it. I'm like a homebody, I love being at home. So yeah, majority of the time I probably will be in the house um, for these. Um, and I think either I'm gonna do like weekly or like every two weeks. It just depends on like what's going on. Yeah, um, cause I guess like some weeks maybe it could be a little bit busier, but majority of the time it'd be kind of the same thing. Um, but yeah, I guess you just can kind of see, you know, what I'm up to day to day, what's going on, what I bought, things like that. Um, it is Monday, August 9th and I am multitasking. I'm working, um, I work from home. Um, so yeah, I work until 4.30 and then after that, I am going to go to the gym and probably go on a walk. It'll just depend, that kind of sounds like a lot. Um, but yeah, I don't know if I'll take you guys with me to the gym because it's just my apartment gym. So it's like, you know, right there. Um, I guess it'll really depend. Maybe I'll can, like bring my phone and like try to do a little bit of video. It just depends what I decide to do. Um, I'm just used to kind of like working out at home. Like I did prior to COVID, I did go to the gym and like work out here of course um just because it's free and i pay for that but um once COVID hit i was like ew you know i'm not going in there and now that like, COVID's like still going on i'm like oh but since i spend so much time at home during the day like you know like i work here um it's like i've kind of like been struggling to work out because i'm here all the time so i feel like if i go to the gym i'm gonna be like yeah i'm already here let's get it done you know get motivated so yeah Gonna try to do that later. I think I am. I guess it'll just depend how many people are in there. I wish I was like a morning workout person, but it's like if I work out in the morning, there's no way I can like complete any other task of the day. Um, I just get so drained from it. So yeah, um, we'll see about that. And then I do have a package coming. I think it's just one thing. And then I have some other packages coming later on this week. So I'll make sure to show you guys those. And I guess just kind of take you along like with what I'm doing. Um, I ate breakfast. Yeah, I just ate my first meal of the day. So I do intermittent, I think that's how you pronounce it, intermittent fasting. Um, so I eat from 12 to 8 p.m. And yeah, that's just what works for me, works best for my body. Um, I feel my best kind of eating that way. Um, I had kind of felt out of it when my boyfriend moved in. But now that, you know, I'm just gonna eat, you know. He cannot eat, whatever. He eats a little bit later than me, so I think that's kind of what threw me off. So I would like, you know, cook a little bit later, but now I'm like, no, you'll just have to eat cold food or heat it up in the microwave. Um, and I think before when I was doing it, I was doing 10.30 to like six or something like that. So it was much earlier. So now with the 12 to eight, I mean, by that time, both of us are hungry, so it works perfectly. So yeah, um, I had a Trader Joe's vegan sausage um i'm not vegan but um i am pescatarian and when i say pescatarian i really don't eat fish like that or shrimp either like i barely so kind of vegetarian but i still have a little bit of that um but yeah i had that and then some eggs with cheese and yeah that should hold me over for a couple of hours and then if i get hungry i'll probably just have a little snack because i love snacks um so yeah i think that's pretty much it for now i can't think of anything else um just i guess glad to be back um i guess like i have to like with there being so much more room i can film like other content that i wanted to do like um like fashion videos or like try on hauls or i mean i guess whatever i want to do um but yeah it's so much more room here like this is a two bedroom we were in a little one bedroom which was my apartment so now we have so much more room and then I have the space to kind of set up my stuff as well um, for YouTube. So yeah, I think that's it. I feel like I can just talk. Like I'm definitely one of those people who can just talk and not really be saying nothing. Or maybe it don't sound like I'm saying something to you guys. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I guess I kind of need to get back to work here. Um, I have a really chill job, honestly. Um, I don't know if I should say what I do I just work in, I work in mortgage. There you go. I work in mortgage and I don't have to talk to anyone. So 
I love that. That's what I like. I like to not talk to people. I don't want to be going back and forth. I will email you, but I don't want people calling me. So this is the perfect job for me. And yeah. So I guess I'll see you guys later. Me again. It is, let's see, same day. It's Monday. It's 6.02. And so I got off work. Um, we went to the gym, worked out. I showed kind of like when I was finishing up. Um, and then we went on a walk and now I'm just watching TLC. I really like TLC. I like, like Bravo and TLC and um, E. But I love like the 90 Day Fiance, the 90 Day The Other Way, all of those. I really like those. So um, yeah, that's what I'm watching. I like to watch them all the time. I just think they're really interesting. And I don't know. I just, I feel like, I don't know. Like reality TV is never real. But I'm like, is are they serious? Because some of this stuff is just so like outlandish. But anyway, I like it. Like TLC used to be like this. I don't know. I feel like back in the day it was like so different and now it's like this like I don't know. I, I feel like it's basically like Bravo. Like it's just a whole bunch of tea and I don't know. It's just interesting. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm going to cook dinner probably around maybe like 6.30 um, and I don't know what I'm gonna eat. Probably just sides. That's usually what I always have. Um, I'm not really like big on shrimp or fish. Like I'll have it sometimes, but it's like I really don't want that majority of the time. So I'll try to have like um, some vegetables and rice or something like that. So yeah, I feel like that's all that's happened. Yeah. Hey guys, welcome back. Today is I skipped yesterday. I really didn't do anything, so I was like, it's pointless to show nothing um today is wednesday august 11th it's 11 21 in the morning um let's see um what am i doing i was outside sitting on our deck and i like to sit outside um i just like to be outside honestly so that's why i have sunglasses on but a bug just flew on me so now i need a break so yeah um my earrings just got here i don't know if i told you guys i ordered some um diamond earrings from blue nile that's where i like to get my diamond earrings from um yeah the ones i have on are not from there and they suck so yeah but if you're looking for earrings diamonds at affordable price affordable yeah i'm gonna say affordable they are i think i got a one fifth carat in there i think 198 yeah but funny story with those um so i accidentally sent them to puerto rico how did I do that? I don't know. And it was like all the signs were there and I still didn't catch that it was going to Puerto Rico. Like when they sent me the thing, it said like Charlotte, North Carolina, PR. And I was like, oh, that means primary residence. Like, no. And then when I paid, I didn't have to pay taxes. And I was like, that's strange. Any other time I pay taxes. And I just, you know, so then it was supposed to come. Um, if you ever order from them, usually it comes like the next day, unless like the weekend, sometimes it doesn't. But like weekday, it'll come the next day. And it was like, it was supposed to come Friday. And then it was like, delay, delay. And I'm like, that's strange. Maybe like something's wrong with the truck. Still not recognizing what I've done. So then Monday I call and I'm like, hey, like, you know, what's going on? And they're like, this is international. I'm like, no, it's going to Charlotte, North Carolina. It was like, no, it's going to Puerto Rico. So then I call them and they're like, okay, we fixed it. And then it's kept saying the same thing. So then I called again the next day. They're like, no, we're gonna send you out a new one. Didn't do that. I called the next day again. There was like, no, you have to wait for those. So they like somehow pulled it back before it went all the way out to Puerto Rico and then took them back to them. And then I had to pay taxes. Of course, they called me and I had to pay taxes and then they sent them to me. So now they're here. So yeah, next time I don't, I don't know how I did that. Like, I don't know. And then I thought it was strange that like, you know, when you put your address in, if it doesn't recognize it, it'll be like, no, you know, this, this, this address we don't recognize okay so yeah it was my fault yeah and they like knew it was my fault like at first i was like trying to play like it wasn't my fault and they're like we didn't do that and i'm like okay i was kind of like annoyed that i had to wait like i think i ordered them almost two weeks ago 
I was kind of annoyed that they like, like the earrings were never coming to me. So I'm like, well, why can't you just take those back and just send me another pair? And I was like, no, you have to get those, but it's fine. They're here now. So yeah, I'm going to go get them. Um, I'm just working. And yeah, oh, and then the only thing I ordered, I said I had like to go get a package. Um, something was wrong with the package locker, so I couldn't get my package out. So yeah, I forgot. And then I went, I made um, Trey go out there later and get my package. And yeah, but only thing I got was just this um, iPhone case. It's black, it's Apple. You see, it's got these marks on that. I don't like that. Like that's the only thing, like it was $30 and it's got these marks on it. Maybe that's my fault. I'll look it up and see. But yeah, like that's all I got. I just wanted like a plain, simple iPhone case. And yeah, love it, like it. I still like it even though it has the marks. Maybe I'll just have to wipe it off all the time or like make sure my hands are dry. So yeah. And then, yeah, I think that's all. Oh, later today I am gonna go to the gym once I get off work. And then maybe I'll go on a walk, maybe not. I feel like you're supposed to like do your cardio first and then do your like lifting and stuff and that's what i do so i feel like going on a walk defeats the purpose but i just really love being outside i'll probably go right back out it's just like i don't know a bug touched me and i'm like oh my god no this this isn't enough like yeah so yeah that's everything as of now i'm gonna go get the earrings and then i'll show you guys and then um oh yeah if you can notice like i have well i have some on this side no no i have some on this side but i'm like out on this one so i haven't got my lashes done and I think I'm going to stop. Like, I think I'm going to take a break. Um, it's just, even though it's affordable, like she's definitely affordable and she's so good. It's just expensive. And I'm like, I don't know. Like, I just, I think I'm over it. Like, I think I'm getting over the phase of lashes. Possibly. We'll have to see when I take them out to like know 100% if I'm really over it. But as of right now, I'm just over it. Like, I don't want to lay there. And I just, I'm like, you could just wear mascara. Like, you know, like, why do I need, I don't know. Not that why do I need lashes, but I just want like short lashes, like my natural ones. But now I'm kind of worried I might not have any good lashes. So yeah, but I think I need to take a break anyway. I've been getting my lashes done since January, every two to three weeks, like no break. So I think it's time for me to get a break and just let my lashes cool. And then if I don't like it, if I don't like the way I look or I like, just can't get used to it, then I'll put those suckers back on. But as of right now, I just, I don't want to spend the money on it. Yeah. I don't know what I'd rather spend my money on. Probably getting my hair done. Yeah. I got my hair done last, oh, maybe it's been two weeks. Okay. I got my hair done two weeks ago. I got a silk press, a deep condition with steam and I got a trim and I'm just like, wow, like. I don't mind doing my hair, but I would prefer that somebody else do it because it's getting long and it's super thick now. Well, I mean, it's long, but it's getting even longer. So, yeah, but she's booked up too. And then my lash girl's kind of booked up too. So it's like, you know, maybe I'll just go without both. But yeah, that's it. That's all I can think of right now. So, yeah. After a long time coming. And I don't want you guys to think they have like terrible customer service. Like any other time, my stuff came the next day. It was my fault. And I guess they were just like, no, girl. You can wait. And I'm like, okay. But they said it could be even longer. I'm trying to keep my face in here. Like my tripod's pretty tall and it's still not fitting. Like I really be struggling. Um, But yeah, customer service is still always good. I always like my diamonds. Yeah, this, this order was placed July 29th. So. <gasps> Here's a little box and this is them oh wait yeah so they're like itty bitty why are they not the same you know what it's probably because they've been everywhere like they literally sat in kentucky for like a week okay yeah so there you go they're perfect this is exactly what i wanted okay so um the only thing is they're not um i think you have to get like the one the one carrots to get screw backs i personally like screw back earrings just because like they're not going nowhere but it's fine these are i have on a screw back i'm gonna show you guys the difference Ooh. okay that'll also okay yeah so these are screw backs these are half a carat yellow gold yeah 14 carat yellow gold okay so yeah i think i, I mean i don't think i spent that much on these but 
Can you see the difference? Yeah, so yeah. Oh my God, this camera's so good. Okay, yeah, so this is more like a gray and this is more of like a white, so. I mean, don't get me wrong, these are still nice diamonds. Like, no complaints, I still love wearing them. But, yeah, and then, um, also, I am into, like, white gold now. Like, I'm over the yellow gold, like, yellow gold. I like yellow gold as, like, like my necklace here is yellow gold. And, like, my bangle, my ring, yellow gold. But, as in for my earrings, I like them white, because I feel like it makes them shine better. Like, I feel like the yellow gold gives them, like, a, um, like a more warm tone. And I'm like, I don't want my earrings to be warm. I want them to be, like, white, bright. So, yeah. Okay, let's see them on. I'm so excited. They're so cute. So cute. Okay. Yeah, so. These are the old ones. They still look really good on camera. I can't even lie to y'all. Okay, but this is, wait, can I do it? I mean, you can kind of see it. Hold on. Okay, there we go. And then they have like this security thing on the back to keep them from like coming out, so yeah. Sorry my face is red, I went outside, it's hot. I had to go get my package. Yeah, I'm not going outside anymore, it's hot. <laughs> like, it's hot. So yeah, I might go later. Um, where we live, like we live where the sun comes up, so once a couple hours goes by, it will cool off. And I can go outside, but as of for now, I'm gonna be in the house. So yeah, that's all that's going on. I'm gonna go ahead and finish working until it's time for me to go to the gym. So yeah. Hey, it's me again. Just really quick. I when I was in like middle school and high school, I was like obsessed with Twilight. Like I was like, it had a hold on me. And it has a hold on me again. Ever since now that it's back on like um, Netflix, like anytime it comes on TV, I watch it. Like don't get me wrong, I watch it. But I, I've literally been watching it. Like this is probably my fifth, sixth time watching it in like two weeks. And it's just, it's got such a hold on me. Like, ugh. it's like nostalgia. I think like, I think that's a feeling like it's like, I think it's like nostalgia. Yeah, it's like, ugh, man, good times. Like, it's like every time I watch it, like, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just like nostalgia for me to watch it. So good. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. Just watching Twilight and working. Hi guys, welcome back. It's, um, what's today? It is Monday, August 16th, and, um, what have I been doing? My sister, my little sister came for the weekend, so we were, like, busy with her, and then, yeah, so we went to Trader Joe's, and I got some food, so I just wanted to show you guys what I like to get from Trader Joe's, and now all of this is mine, so, um, I don't eat... I don't eat fruit, I don't eat raw fruit or um, raw vegetables, so um, some of the stuff is um, choice, so yeah. Okay, so first thing are these raw corn tortilla chips, chili and lime. These are so good. These are like Takis, but the Trader Joe's. Let me try and take it down. Okay, I'm back. Oh, I'm just gonna sit. I think you can see that right now. Oh, and then the next one. Panera, but, okay, so, yeah, so we got these, I love these, these are so good, they're like the coffee, super good, I got some pita chips, because I got, oh, there's some other stuff, okay, I got some hummus, um, I got Cuban style black beans, I saw some on TikTok talking about these, so I got them, because I really like black beans, we got some spinach, um, I'm gonna cook that with, I guess, like, breakfast or something, um, Troy got some shawarma chicken thighs. I don't eat chicken, only fish. And then he got some pineapple. That's all he got. He likes to get the majority of his groceries from Walmart. So I do like a little bit of everything. So I'll usually start off at like Walmart or Trader Joe's and like pick up whatever left over. Cause I don't like everything at Trader Joe's. I only like some stuff. So yeah, we still have to go there. So. I love the hash browns. I like to do the hash browns and then put like scrambled eggs on top with cheese. So I got that. Um, I got the JoJo's. I heard everybody saying these are better than Oreos. So I got those in vanilla. Um, let's see. Oh, I love these. I got the roasted potatoes with peppers and onions. Um, this is Kung Pu Temple. 
Kung Pao, sorry. Um, tempura, cauliflower. Her these are good. I feel like they're gonna be super nice. Um, oh yeah, okay, so I got the dill pickle hummus. Yeah. I think that'll be really good. Some frozen spinach. Um, I got the apple blossoms. I never had these before, but it's worth a try. And broccoli. And eggs. Yeah, eggs. And then I got some vitamin E oil. My skin has been super dry lately, so um, I've like tried everything. So this is what I'm going to try now. So hopefully it works. We shall see. But I used to have this. I think I threw it away. Um, so yeah, I feel like that's going to take care of it, but it's like my, like around my nose, my lips is super dry right now. So hopefully that clears it for me. So yeah, so I'm going to put this up and then we're going to have dinner and I guess I'm going to continue the vlog on because, um, I just don't like showing my family or anyone on camera just because like, this is my channel. They didn't sign up for it. So yeah, I definitely didn't want to show my sister, but, um, I mean, we did have a fun weekend, but you know, some stuff is for the camera and some stuff is not so yeah so we're just gonna continue this on through the week oh i washed my hair yeah and this is um what is this i guess it's a twist out so what i did was i did my wash and go and then i just twitched it each section and then set it in the dryer because it was late i always want to do my hair late at night not late at night but like eight o'clock so it's like time to go to bed so yeah i think i'm gonna take a break from straightening it just because it's so hot outside i just feel like why am i doing this and then i'm like trying to work out so i'm like you know so yeah i think i'm just gonna take a break we should see because i really like as you know i don't live up to my word like i said that before and then i straightened it so i feel like if i put rules on what i'm gonna do then i'll do the opposite so yeah i'm just this is this is it as of right now so yeah and um i should have showed you guys when i was like doing it but my hair has gotten so much better like with my curls like my curls are back to normal and um don't look at this side one side of my hair doesn't curl as well as this side ever since like the beginning it's always like it's always taking heat it's just not as good as like the rest of my hair um so when i apply heat on this side it just doesn't do as well so yeah Hi guys, welcome back. Um, what's today? I have no idea. Let's see. Okay, today is Friday, August 20th. It's 12, almost 12. It's a couple minutes short of 12. My hair looks really big. But yeah, so I have to go to the dentist today. So I took the day off because I just, y'all know how it is. Yeah, so I took the day off. So I'm going to go to the dentist and then I need to go to Trader Joe's to get... I'm gonna get this shampoo and conditioner, like the, you know, the one that everybody wants, that everybody uses. Um, so I'm gonna get that. And then I think I need to go to the beauty supply to get some like foam rollers. So I'm gonna do that too. And I feel like that's all I'm gonna do. I was gonna dye my hair black cause my new growth is growing. But I think I'm just gonna let it be. Like I actually like it. So I'm not gonna mess with that. I'm gonna leave that alone. And then um, I'm going to wash and condition my hair either today or tomorrow. I kind of want to go to the pool tomorrow so that would be kind of pointless i just have to check the weather and see but i'm going to show you guys like kind of like the process of me excuse me i'm going to show you guys the process of me washing deep conditioning and then styling my hair um yeah this is a twist out i think i said that last time this is a twist out so i don't think i'm going to do a twist out i might kind of have to do like a twist on this side because this side of my hair right here is i think i said that too this is the part that like a little bit of heat, a little bit of anything, it, the curls are not as good. So I might have to twist that side, but the rest of it is fine. I don't really have that much heat damage anymore, thank God. So yeah, I think that's all I'm doing. Okay, I am back home now from the dentist. Um, I just went to do like the, you know how you, before, I don't know if you guys know, I'm tired. But when you go to the dentist, it's like they give you kind of like a plan of what you need to do. My plan's always very expensive, so yeah. But I went back to Trader Joe's, so I got the shampoo that I wanted. I used to use this back when I was like getting into like my natural hair a long time ago. So, oh, okay, I thought I got two of the wrong things. Okay, so I got the Tingle one. What is it? 
the tea tree tingle. So I got these to wash my hair. And then last time I was there, I couldn't find the meatless meatballs. So I got those. And then I love the breakfast patty. So yeah, I didn't go to the beauty supply and get the rollers because I didn't want to. I wanted to come back home. So yeah, let me show you guys what I have on. I hope I look okay. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so this is from Zara. It was a bodysuit, but I cut it. So now it's the top. And then these are from PLT. And then I have on these like easy slide dupes from, it's from Ego. So yeah, I'm probably gonna wash my hair in a little bit. I was gonna wash it now, but I'm gonna wait because um, I ordered a scalp massager to wash my hair. And I used to have one, but now I can't find it. I probably threw it away because that's something I would do. So yeah, I'm probably just gonna chill. I might go to the pool, might not, it's kind of hot. But yeah, I'm just gonna do my hair later on today. So yeah, or I might do it tomorrow because I think, I think when Troy gets home, he wants to go to the mall. And I have nothing to do, so I feel like, why not? So yeah, might not even do my hair today, might do it tomorrow. But anyway, I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. So yeah, that's it for now. Okay, so good morning. It is, what is it? It's Saturday. The 21st, yeah, and I changed my mind. I'm gonna straighten my hair. I just want to straighten my hair, so yeah, I just want to show you guys what it looks like. What this is it, yeah, let me see if you can see the one, yeah, and I just got a trim in July. Wow, that was a while ago, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and straighten it. I already have a video here on YouTube with my straightening hair routine, it's literally the same, like everything single thing about that is the exact same so yeah hi guys welcome back so i finished my hair um i decided to curl it so yep it's curled um yeah so this is how it looks i don't know if you can tell yeah um it's starting to fall my hair always curls when it comes to curls um but yeah so i've already done my makeup we're going to be going to greensboro today um we're going to go get food with troy's family Sorry, I'm looking how my curls keep falling. Um, so we're gonna go get food with Troy's family at some like crab place, good crab bowl place. And then um, we're gonna go bowling possibly, and then we're gonna come back. And that's basically the end of this vlog. Once we do all that, that's that, that's everything. Um, I mean, I kind of showed you guys everything I do. I don't really do a lot. I'm really, I'm really a homebody, which is what I like. Um, so. Yeah, I haven't got dressed yet. He told me to be ready by four and we're not leaving to five. I guess he was like trying to keep me on time because I do be behind. So yeah, I'm just going to chill for now and then I'll show you guys what I decided to wear. I'm probably just going to do a pair of Zara jeans and a Zara bodysuit or like Abercrombie bodysuit and some sandals. Yeah, I feel like I should wear black just because, you know, when it comes to like a crab bowl, it gets kind of messy. I'm not the type of person to drop it on me. I'm like, eh, I should wear black. And I'm like, black is so hot and it's so hot outside. So, yeah, that's everything as of now. Um, I did use my other straightener. I think I'm gonna have to put my hair up in pin curls maybe. Um, I did use my hot tool straightener today, this one. Um, just because I feel like it's a little bit thicker, like the, um, I don't want to say the barrel, but like the actual flat iron piece. I think it's a little bit bigger so that way I can get more hair. So it didn't take me as long. I think it took me probably like maybe like 35 minutes to do my hair. Well, just to straighten it. And then I went back in and curled it after. And that's probably why my curls are falling because my hair, like whatever you do to it the first time, that's what it's going to be. So it's probably like, girl, you're tripping. So usually what I do sometimes is I'll like straighten it. And then let like it start to get greasy usually it starts to get greasy in like four or five days and then i'll go in and curl it because if it's greasy it'll hold a curl but i did not like the way the straight was looking like i just like a good curl like a light little body curl so yeah i feel like that's everything i have to say right now yeah and then i'll put my lipstick on i don't have any lipstick but i'm just gonna do my charlotte tilbury iconic nude and Probably a lipstick, that way it doesn't get all over my mouth and I have to wear a mask, so yeah. But I will show you guys once I decide. Okay, so this is what I'm wearing, I think. So um, I think this is from 
PLT maybe. And then these are my Agoldi shorts. They're like a little short, but it's fine. Um, and then I'm just probably gonna wear these little sandals, I think. Huh? Okay. I'm gonna wear these sandals maybe. You see them? Like this. Maybe not. Maybe I'll wear different ones. Um, okay, and then I pull my hair out. This is my hair. And then my lip combo. Okay, my lips is KKW2 lip liner and then the Kylie lip, what is it called? Liquid lipstick in Kylie, yeah. So yeah, I think I'm gonna put on a little necklace. I just gotta hurry up. He's, he's rushing me now, so I gotta go. But yeah, I think I like it. Except for this like short situation right here, but it's really too hot and yeah. Okay. Hey guys, me again, same day. Um, so we just got done eating. I literally forgot to take a picture of my food, so I'm sorry. Um, I just got fried shrimp and french fries and Trey got a, a crab bowl, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, so yeah, we're about to go bowling now. And then after we go bowling, we're going to head back to Charlotte. And I guess this is like the end of the video. Yeah, because we're not doing anything else. Yeah, and I didn't do my nails. I'm probably going to do them tomorrow. But um, I think I've already showed that in like my maintenance vlog, so I'm not going to film that. And yeah, I just want to show you guys this Kylie lip. Um, so I ate my food and I ate some of his too. And it's still on there pretty well. So I know a lot of people, I know the old Kylie ones people had issues with. Personally, me, I didn't. I love the Kylie lip kits. Yeah, I really like the. I don't like to use them together, like, because it's like the same color. I don't like that. But I do like them because they last really well. So yeah. Okay, it's me again. So um i i don't know if i mentioned that i actually took my lashes out yeah i just took them out and i'm just loving the mascara i do really think i might be over that phase of course i'm not sure we'll have to see what i like in a couple of weeks but right now i'm really liking just the mascara and this is the l'oreal um i'm not sure the name but i'll make sure to put it in the description box for you guys but yeah i just wanted to say i took those out and i'm really loving my natural lashes so yeah Oh, and I, I don't know if I told you guys, I put my, this is the jury. I think it's on the back way. It's always like that. It's always turned around. So I have my little um, diamond pendant on. Is this what it's called? A diamond little, yeah. And this is from Etsy. Um, I can put it in the description. And then I just have my little Majuri ring on. And then my um, diamond earrings from, where they're from? Blue Nile. So, yeah. Okay.